A fight in a crowded neighborhood bar uh, escalates. Multiple people are stabbed, and now one person is in jail facing charges. It was supposed to be a New Year's Eve celebration until things took a near deadly turn at a bar in Taylor. Good evening, everybody. I'm Kimberly Gill, in for Karen Drew. And I'm Damon Fernandez. That arrest comes after three people were inside the halftime bar. Right now, one of the victims is speaking out, explaining how she says she almost lost her life. And I want to warn you, some of what you're about to see and hear here is disturbing. Like, I felt myself die. Like, I literally felt like I was dying. Fighting back tears, Ashley Picard's recalling the chaos that happened inside Halftime Bar in Taylor on New Year's Eve. My whole torso was just covered in blood. I was soaked. It was supposed to be a fun night, ringing in the new year with friends and family. But the 28-year-old says an argument among others inside the bar, allegedly over a game of pool, escalated into a full-on brawl. There's a lot of people there. Police say three patrons were stabbed. I never got back up. I just got started getting stomped on, and they started beating my I didn't even know I was being stabbed because I, the adrenaline, you know what I'm saying? It was just so crazy. I truly did not know I was being stabbed. Like, I had no clue. Picard was rushed to the hospital. She now has stab wounds and staples covering her body. So I have um, this one right here. From her arms to her abdomen. I think this is the one that cleansed my lung. There's several cuts across her upper and lower back, too. It all could have been prevented. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, it all could have been prevented. Taylor police say they arrested a suspect late Wednesday night. The unidentified man is due in court this week. Picard says she's now focused on healing. I'm sick about this. Like, you know, like, it's just making me move different with people around me and people move differently with me. Now, police are telling me this remains an ongoing investigation. More arrests could come. I did stop by the halftime bar today. No one there would comment.